So my name is Rachel Schmoker and I'm from Vermont, Alaska and I'm a senior in the Health and Human Performance major with emphasis on community health and I'll be getting two minors, one in International Development Studies and the other in Global Public Health. I've always been interested in Africa, particularly in rural access to healthcare. And while it's kind of hard to get into that setting immediately, um, working in the township of Cape Town was a really great way to kind of get my foot in the door. And so working with the HIV AIDS organization, kind of working within the community and figuring out what their healthcare problems are and how they deal with healthcare issues was a really great way to, for, for me to kind of reflect on my academics and put them into real, real world experience. It separates out into four years. You have different requirements each year. And for the junior year, you have an out-of-classroom experience. And that can either be an internship or a study abroad or work experience. And um, so I received funding to be able to go to Cape Town, which was amazing because otherwise I wouldn't have been able to. Um, and so I went all the way over to Cape Town. And I wrote, um, I did some requirements for them. But I actually came away with um, receiving 10, 10 credits. Whether or not if you, that'll be your only experience and you come back and you work in the States and you live there forever, it, it, that's totally awesome. But I think having that experience will really broaden your ability to communicate with people and kind of see where people are coming from different paths and different walks of life and then also realizing that they're all kind of doing the same thing and trying to just be happy, amazing people. And so going abroad definitely allowed me to at least realize that it's, the world is a small place and there are amazing people all over the world and having the opportunity to meet different people and experience and be part of a different culture was, was really life changing.